three easy ways to beat a defender. We're not giving you that basic bull today. We've got the real magic. Let's go. Three ways to beat a defender. The first one, the defender can dive in. Next, you can go around the defender. And my favorite, of course, you can make the defender disappear. Did I, did I disappear? That very first one is an easy one for us, all right? Any defender that comes in with momentum is going to get destroyed by the fact that all you have to do is change one direction and they're gone, all right? So don't overcomplicate things. This is the very first one. Wait till you're doing the skills and the other things to complicate the game. A defender comes in, you faint, a little step over, pass the ball around them, or just use your own momentum to run right past them. That's all you need to do. Don't overcomplicate things, guys. Use your momentum against the defender. <laughs> oh, now, the defender is set. What do you do? Obviously, because he's backing up and because he's going away from you, you're not gonna be able to use the momentum against him. You've gotta come up with something different. And that means your skills have to come into play. It doesn't mean that you need to do six step overs. It doesn't mean that you have to do an elastico. What it means is that you have to now set it up where you have the advantage. And to do that, you need to bring speed into the equation. So, you're never gonna run around someone by going like this, nice and slow. They're just gonna take the ball from you. They're ready for that. If you wanna go around a defender, you have to set up the exact same situation that we had in our first example. Momentum, get the defender to move. If he's not moving, you can't go around him, all right? So we wanna build up speed, as much speed as we can, and then you can stop, then you can go. Stop and go is an easy way to get around a defender without doing any skill moves at all. Now, if you are a technical player, you can do step overs, all right? Set them up with pace and speed, but attack the defender. You will never go around a defender slowly, all right? They're too good, they're ready for it, they can use their body, they have everything in their favor. What you wanna do is drive at this defender immediately. Once you get that ball, attack, attack, attack. That way, you can score goals right after you go around them. And then you can learn the hardest, to, uh, did I say to throw a ball? Did anyone hear me say to throw? Yeah, let's, ball. Jesus Christ, guys. Now, on the other hand, if you want to make a defender just like that, well, there's a little bit of a pattern. There's a little bit of a flow that you're going to need to do, all right? So not only are you going to need to attack the defender, you are also going to need to throw in all sorts of feints, misdirection, all of this stuff. Look at guys like Robinho, all right? Look at guys like Vinicius Jr., okay? Look at Sané. All these guys, look at Dembele with that cut, all right? If you want players to move out of your way, that's a whole nother thing. We're not using momentum, they're not set. It means that he is there, I'm here, and in two seconds, I've, I'm able to, with my feints, with my little bit of momentum, with a cut, I'm able to get him to go that way, and I just walk straight into the goal. Tons of clips you guys can check out, but if you really wanna learn how to do this, you have to practice, and you have to practice alone. For the love of God, do not just wait until you are at training with somebody else in order for you to do this. You have to do it alone. Grab the ball, attack something that is not there, do a couple feints, and boom, you're out. Just like this. That's the vid, my friends. You know exactly what we need you to do. Leave us a like, comment, subscribe. Check out everything we've got for you right down below in the description box from us here at Unisport, and we will see you guys later.